hey guys welcome back to the channel if this is your first time watching welcome to daily crave and in today's video i will be installing wheel hooks i just forgot what i had So I don't know where we at in this video. I just picked back up the camera because I was getting a little irritated and just that in the third because <clears throat> this was a lot more than I expected. I had to take off the whole caliper and um these bolts back here in a pretty tight spot. So yeah. So I don't know where exactly yet, but right now I'm trying to get this uh rotor off and then if i get this rotor off i can take off this wheel hook so yeah so now let's just speed up the process and keep it moving No, I ain't never. Now, I know this rotor supposed to fall off, but right now it's not even falling off it. And then I don't know if it's rested on there. I don't know if that's supposed to be like that or what, but that's rest. As you can see, this is the bad rotor, and then let me show you the good one. Alright, so side by side comparison old and rusty, new and shiny. So, yeah. Now I just got through doing the driver side. Now we're gonna switch over and do passenger side. So I don't know if this is normal wear and tear or if it's supposed to be like that. Got it going? Yeah. All right, guys, so it's been two days later, and I know that I really didn't explain what was going on with my car. I just, like, let y'all heard the clicking and none of that, but my car has been, like, every time I accelerate, it'll, like, click. Every time I reverse, I click, and I've been trying to figure out what the issue was, and it was my wheel hooks. Now, it fixed part of my issue, but not all of the issue. I got to get the, um... 
I gotta get my gears changed because now I know that that's that's the only problem that's left. This is my gears. My I've had my 373 gears um, for over a year now, and I just haven't made time to get them installed and haven't found nobody really to um, to install them yet. But that's that'll be coming up here pretty soon, hopefully. But um, yeah, that fixed part of the issue, and the install was. I looked at. I was trying to do it to CJ. Um, like CJ Pony Parts, his video, how he had showed, um, like doing it, but that was that was gonna take me so long. Like that was, dude, I had got so annoyed. Like I had stopped recording everything, but it, um, I ended up thanks thanks to my dad. He helped me out a lot, and I really appreciate him for helping me. I, um, we end up doing the other side. We end up doing the other side in less than like an hour we got it down in less than an hour because that was my first time doing a wheel hub like ever and that was doing it the cj pointing parts way i would have took me like two days because i didn't i was i was on that one side for like eight hours but anyway guys i really appreciate each and every each and every last one of y'all for clicking on my video subscribing to my channel and leaving comments it means so much to me and I would love to hear your guys' feedback on what you'd like for me to do next, like performance-wise, exterior-wise, interior-wise, like anything. What do you guys want to see next done to this car? Because I'm sort of, I don't really know exactly what I want to do next. I got some more stuff that I'm finna get ready to put on the car, but I don't really know exactly what I want to do next. And yeah. If you could leave a comment saying what you would like to see done to this car, I really appreciate it. But without further ado, I'll see you guys in the next one.